Hi guys, this is my updated foundation routine. If you want to know how I turn this into this flawless base, so keep on watching. Skin preparation is the most important thing to create a flawless base, so I always make sure I use my serum after I wash my face before bed and before I do foundation. These are my favorite products and after that I apply eye cream. At the moment I'm using this SK2 eye cream which I got the sample size when I bought the SK2 product and I love using this Napoleon Produce Autopilot Radiant Boosting Mask. I just need a tiny bit of it, apply it all over my face. These products and the serum give such a flawless looking skin. It makes the base really smooth and they give hydration to the skin. Leave it 5 to 10 minutes until it's set. While waiting, I'm moisturizing my lips with any lip balms or chapsticks. Next, ready for the foundation routine. I always apply primer. Napoleon Produce Autopilot Foundation Primer is my favorite it makes my foundation last so much longer and at the moment i'm back loving my revlon color stay and this one is in a shade 330 i love mixing this with the primer itself to give a little bit more sheer coverage and i'm blending everything with my real techniques buffing brush I'm buffing the foundation with a circular motion so it will sunk into my skin. Next is concealer. I'm switching between these two, the Maybelline Fit Me number 20 or the Prolong Concealer in NC30. For this video, I'm using the Prolong Concealer. I love applying it with my fingers because it warms up the products to my skin a lot better than any sponge or anything. This Prolong Concealer also amazing for eye base. I'm putting it to the one side first so you can see the difference without a concealer. And I'm setting it with a translucent powder. This one is by Face Australia. Now you can see with under eye concealer and without under eye concealer. After that, setting my foundation with this Napoleon Perdis Camera Finish Powder. I'm in the shade Look G4. It's a must step for me because I've tried using other foundation, BB cream or anything. It just looks flawless with this powder. So I'm done with the base. So this is before and this is after doing the foundation routine. And this one after the rest of the makeup and my hair done. So that is how I do my foundation routine. I hope this video is helpful for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!